might have heard about Abram Ward's initiative that helps local people join an existing or start their own community business. You might also be unsure about how you become part of this initiative known as Made in Wigan. We made this video to put you and anyone with a role to play in the picture. The Made in Wigan initiative is for people from all corners of the community. We're here to support school children, young adult learners and those leaving education who are asking, what next? Carers looking after loved ones who might just need a break. Those of us out of work and struggling to find a job or whose roles have been made redundant, but who still have a lot to give. Equally, people who want to remain actively involved in something, even after retirement. And anyone else for that matter, who for whatever reason, find themselves socially isolated, perhaps through personal circumstances, such as a disability, or mental health challenge. Our main headquarters is at Platbridge Community Zone and we also have a shop premises on Hope Street in Wigan Town Centre. At either of these two locations we are able to meet with you to find out more about your personal circumstances, about your interests and skills, and to work with you to link you with an existing or develop a new community business venture. Here at Made in Wigan, we are forging relationships with many different individuals, organisations and institutions. We've created an ever-growing network of support providers and you may recognise your own role as being from within one of the following sectors. If you work in education, we want to work with you to ensure that whether at primary, secondary, further or alternative training settings, the students you come into contact with are aware of the Made in Wigan initiative and how it might provide them with a way into work. Do you work for Wigan Council or one of the Council's partners? As such, you'll be in one of many roles that bring you into contact with community members who benefit from the support of Made in Wigan. Whether through your individual role, a Council initiative, a department or collaboration such as the deal for Wigan businesses, we want to hear from you so that together we can identify those people who benefit the most. We also want to further develop our various cooperative contacts with Greater Manchester Chamber, along with the national, government-driven initiatives that are already gaining momentum. you're the owner of or an employee for one of the many incredible borough businesses. We've already benefited from mentoring expertise of professionals who are supporting the growth of community businesses and we are looking for more businesses from across the spectrum of industries that want to give back by providing their guidance to our fledgling community business owners with the support of both Cooperatives UK and CLES, the National Organisation for Local Economies. We also work closely with many other third sector organisations 
and there are many more that we'd like to hear from. If you work for a third sector organisation and you feel that you've identified service users who would benefit from a chat with us, then get in touch and we'll arrange a meeting with you. Many of our community business owners come to us via an introduction from a community group. Are you running a community group? Then get in touch and we'll explain more about how your members could potentially become owners of their own community businesses. We've started to create content that is shared digitally on our various online platforms. We want to hear from content creators whose goal it is to make the connection between individuals and the needs of the local community. We believe that there are many opportunities to bring individuals together. Both printed and digitally, content creators are a vital link between our initiative and the people who can benefit the most. We're extremely proud of the connections that we've made across the above sectors. We're committed to ensuring that we continue to connect with all organisations in order to grow the understanding of our initiative. To grow the support network within Made in Wigan and to ultimately grow the number of community businesses over the coming months and years owned and run by the people from within the community.